Hey everyone, Pets Card Collection back at you with another break. Today's video, we're going to be opening up a blaster box of 2020 Topps Gypsy Queen Baseball. So rather than buying a hobby box for $130, uh, I decided to buy four blaster boxes for about $80 from Walmart. Uh, as some of you may know, the price for Gypsy Queen has gone from about eighty to a hundred dollars per hobby box and now it's at a hundred and thirty dollars per hobby box so uh the product is really nice there's a lot of great cards and due to not many cards uh coming out recently uh, the demand is definitely going up and the supply is staying the same and dwindling so decided to try my luck with the blaster boxes and was lucky enough to find a whole bunch at walmart on friday uh, I've been going on Fridays now and I've been having better luck in terms of finding supply. I'm not sure if that's related to the coronavirus scaring people away or if it's related to just going at the right time of the week when they're stocked the shelves. But with that being said, um, from what I've seen, the blaster boxes are really, really nice, really good. Uh, if you want to take a look at the odds real quick, be my guest. Uh, but... I think they really do a nice job uh, with these because from what I've seen, you you get you, you usually get at least one uh, so, something, one really good card, uh, either a logo swap or missing nameplate or Jackie Robinson sort print or even an autograph. So you get, let's see, three, seven packs and then one green parallel pack. So we'll start with the regular packs here. I've opened a hobby box and monster box and I've done pretty well so far with this. So I'm pretty excited to test out a blaster. Still looking for a Luis Robert rookie card. So hopefully we can pull one in this blaster box. We'll see, that would be very nice. Kepler, DeYoung, Nunez, Rogers. I was thinking uh, the bazooka backs are heritage, so I was not sure what I'm looking for there, but all right, here we go. Sean Murphy, rookie card. Nick Senzel, Aaron Savale, rookie. Fletcher, and Gene Segura. First two packs, not too, too much doing. Next up, we got a Mitch Garver, Dylan Cease rookie, Vasquez, and that's a nice one. Will Smith missing nameplate, very nice. Probably going to be the starting catcher for the Dodgers, really good hitter as well as defender. So I'll take that any day of the week. I think that's my second or third missing nameplate. Then we got a Snell Zilla and a Burke rookie card. Let me know if you've ripped any Gypsy Queen or if you've pulled anything big out of it. Uh, if you haven't already, definitely check out my Monster Box. I got a ton of hits in that in that one. I think it was a Hot Box. Ooh, that's a nice one. Brendan McKay rookie card. I think we got a Fortune Teller coming up. And it is a Williams Astudio fortune teller card. Pretty nice. Big fan of these fortune teller cards. Got that old, like, vintage kind of style. And a Fernando Tatis. Very cool. Very, very cool. All right. Harold Ramirez. James Paxton. Gold, Goldschmidt, Buxton, Otani, and Archie Bradley. Brandon Belt, Michael Soroka, Slam Tana, Alexander, and a Wilson Ramos. So, last base pack before we get to our green parallel pack hopefully we can maybe pull something nice out of there 
Looks like we might have one of those uh, Tarot of the Diamond inserts coming on up. Those are pretty cool inserts. I pulled a nice uh, Boba Chet rookie of that. And we got a Bellinger. So that's a cool one. Tarot of the Diamond Gypsy Queen insert. Very, very nice card. Then we got Michael Bias. I actually got his autograph from my hobby box that I pulled. So that was awesome. He's like a 6'8 pitcher and uh, really good stuff. So hopefully he can take off. Robbie Ray. And then we will get to our last pack. This is the green parallel pack. Open for one of the bigger rookies. Appreciate you all watching this video again. Hope you're all doing well. Got a Trevor story. Harrison Bader, Shane Bieber, Javier Baez, and the last one, Eloy Jimenez. So not too shabby, pretty nice box. Didn't hit too many huge rookies, but did get a couple nice inserts and missing nameplate. So we'll do a quick little recap here. The hits of the box, we got a Williams Astudio fortune teller card, very cool. La Tortuga. Then we got ourselves a Cody Bellinger, the star. Very nice. Brendan McKay, rookie card. And the hit of the box is definitely going to be this Will Smith missing nameplate. Very nice card. So that does it for the break. Thanks to you all for watching this video, and I hope you all have a great day. Pets Card Collection out. Take care.